Well, I took this bad boy out shooting today, and as expected, it shot like a champ. But uh, I did a little something different at the beginning. What I did was um, I kind of try to get a little proof for myself of, of something somebody said or, or I heard that if you don't, uh, if you leave your barrel oily and you don't run a dry patch through the the barrel uh, from say the last time you cleaned it or the last time you preserved it that you're going to lose accuracy. Well, um, I did that. I, I ran a dry patch through it. I shot it. I think the, the range was like 25 yards and then I shot it uh, and then I think I shot 10 rounds and then uh, after I shot it with a dry patch I, I sprayed oil down in the barrel and I let the oil run all the way down into the receiver and I showed that on camera and I shot it again and um, well see for yourself I have my rudder dry patch through it Come on. Oh, I gotta see this I'll be shooting at the upper right. Uh, can you see the oil in there? Oh, yeah. Yep. All right, the oil's coming out. All right, I'm going to shoot at the upper left. Okay. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. So my groupings are actually a little better here than here. Now it did throw off the point of aim a little bit, but mm -hmm. I don't see where the, uh, where the accuracy is any worse or any better. So from the footage you saw, um, I really couldn't tell any difference between the dry barrel and the oily barrel. So here's the dry and I measured it out the, the extremes of my grouping at 25 yards with open sights and it was kind of dark and my sights kind of suck. But the, this is just a point of comparison and, and nothing really scientific but uh, I got a three inch spread there from, from the furthest points away and actually it was better with the oily barrel. Um, two and a half inches from uh, the furthest two shots. So, uh, it, it, there's probably some truth to it, but for me, for the average shooter, 
uh, I would say it's negligible. Uh, I, that's just my initial thoughts. Uh, if anybody has any experience with uh, oil in the barrel actually throwing off your your accuracy, uh, now definitely the the point of aim. My point of aim aim was actually the bullseye, and and it did change the point of impact. But I think that's more me than the rifle. Otherwise, um, over time, you would think that after the first few shots, the the um, the point of impact would change. But uh, I think I think the difference is just more me than anything else. But anyway, uh. After that, I went to town and, and I just had a little fun. So, uh, watch the rest of the video and enjoy. With that, that's all I got. See you later.